And up first at 11 is a story that would horrify any parent. Police say that two toddlers somehow made their way out onto the roof of a townhouse. The children's mother is facing some serious charges tonight. But ABC 7 spoke exclusively with the children's mother, who says that's not true. Only on 7, Roz Plater live in the newsroom with all sides to this story. Roz? Allison, there are two very different accounts of what happened here. The mother says this is all one big misunderstanding. Her children may have been at the window, not on the roof, but law enforcement says it is felony child neglect. Investigators say 1030 Tuesday morning, a concerned citizen called 911 to report two small children were in danger playing on the dormer roof of this townhome in the rain. When the deputies arrived, the first thing they observed were the two toddlers that were in fact indeed outside on a roof. Uh, it was rainy, cold. Captain Pierce says the deputies rushed inside, rescued the kids ages two and three, found a nine month old in a playpen, and the parents fast asleep. It's a misunderstanding. The family tells a very different story. I'm a mom, so I, I fall asleep, but I still can hear what's going on. Never heard a peep out of their room. Never. Next thing I know at 10 30, I'm woken up to the cops running in my room. And her family does not believe the kids were actually out on the roof. The screen was in the window, so therefore they would have to open the screen up. And you know the two little buttons you got to push down to open up? No, they, ain't, they don't have the, you know, two and three year old, they ain't going to be able to do that. You look at that roof and you tell me you have a two year old can stand on that roof without falling. Nancy Gillikin and her husband Michael both now face four counts of felony child neglect, and their kids were temporarily taken away. I'm going to fight. And I'm going to tell those cops they need to show me proof that my children were on that roof. They're hurting my children more than they're hurting anybody because I have dedicated my life to my kids. I don't care what happens to me, but when, when it involves my kids, that's just not right. For now, a relative has temporary custody of all four of the children. The parents have a court date mid-February. The sheriff tells us the couple has faced misdemeanor child neglect charges in 2010. Live in the newsroom, I'm Miles Plater, ABC 7 News. Okay.